The League of Women Voters of Marquette County wants the public to know about two upcoming events related to redistricting in the state of Michigan. Local 3's Brianna McLean is in the studio with more. Brianna? Back in 2018, 61% of Michigan voters voted in favor of Proposal 2 to end gerrymandering in state elections. This transferred the power to draw the state's congressional and legislative districts from the state legislature to an independent redistricting commission. Over the next few months, the commission will be holding hearings across the state to allow the public to voice their opinions and ask questions when it comes to redistricting lines. I think one of the most important things is the way it used to be done in the past was behind closed doors and nobody knew what was happening until the lines got drawn. This new commission is done in the light of day. Every one of their meetings is, is live streamed and it is recorded on video. You can go watch all of them on, on the website, which is um, redistrictingmichigan.org. Um, everything they do is in the open and the citizens of, of Michigan get to participate. So that's a brand new thing and that's why these public hearings are important and that's why it's important for people to show up and say what they hope will be done with these lines. The Independent Citizens Redistricting Commission public hearing for the Upper Peninsula will be at NMU's Northern Center in Marquette on Tuesday, May 19th from 6 p.m. to 9 p.m. It can be attended in person or virtually. And on Thursday, May 13th at 7 p.m., a multi-county webinar on county-level redistricting will be held. It will be hosted by the League of Women Voters chapters from the Copper Country, Eastern UP, Marquette County, and Northern Lower Michigan. For webinar links and to read more information on these upcoming events, you can visit our website, upmatters.com. Reporting in the studio, Brianna McLean, Local 3 News.